For sound this morning. Go straight in. Don't listen to him. Just drive in. Get in. These two abortion supporters are working very hard to get these children killed here, here this morning. But thankfully, God's grace continues to flow, and one mother is choosing life at this very moment in the mobile ultrasound. And you can look at the sour looks on their faces when they heard that a mom had chosen life. And this is a letter of thanks from a mother who chose life because she, now she covers her face. Because these pro-life sidewalk counselors were here to offer help. This mother and this baby both have life and joy because these pro-lifers were here. You are the, intimidating and a bully. They can't stand the truth about life. God bless you. You know, isn't this kind of a sign from God that just this morning, this letter from a mother who chose life is brought to us with a picture of her happy family. She, this mother, was in this driveway a few years ago. And you know, if these abortion supporters were here screaming and ranting at them to go kill their babies, there's a good chance this mother might not have stopped and received the life-saving information from the pro-life sidewalk counselors. This letter and this picture is just proof that what these women are here for is to promote the death of children and the pain and loss of women. How horrible, how, how terrible. And yet, when I try and show her the picture of that beautiful child, she covers her face and she covers her face. They are so afraid to look at the truth that these sidewalk counselors are here to bring life and love to people. You sure? Please, just take a look at this child who was saved from abortion here. Just look at her. How beautiful. Yes! <laughs> yeah. The, the, the shout of joy from the abortion supporter that a child will die. She covers her face when she sees this child who lives, yet she screams for joy when a child is going to die. How horrible. How sad. On Wednesday of this week, a woman came to the clinic and she went inside and after about two minutes in there, she came out and said she couldn't stand it in there. It was so oppressive and she came out and asked for help. Thankfully, she's come back today to use the mobile ultrasound and choose life. Ladies, what do you think of the second mother today using the free mobile ultrasound to choose life? So the, the hand tells it all. You want it stopped. You don't want these women to use the free ultrasound, but they are. Lives are being saved. Children are being loved. And God's grace is flowing thanks to these good pro-life sidewalk counselors and these pro-life people who are here offering life, love, and support to these women. Another child this morning, the second, is being saved in the mobile ultrasound. Earlier when we saw a mother go in who was angry, you guys were jumping for joy that the child would be killed. Now you're just hiding your faces. Can't you be happy that a baby is being saved? We thank God for his grace and his goodness this morning. This morning at Rockford's abortion mill, three mothers have used the pro-life mobile ultrasound to choose life for their children. The power of prayer and of love is winning this battle against the culture of death. And as you can see these people praying, and as you can see the mobile ultrasound in the distance, you can see people who are coming together to love and help mothers and children in need. And you can see the power of Christ and of life defeating the culture of death.